Happy birthday. <laughs> Say hi. Oh my god, it's so cute. <laughs> Glass. Put your hand for size with that shot glass. Yeah. <laughs> I have an ugly hand. No, your hands look beautiful. Yes. <laughs> that's a, yeah, that's a big. <laughs> and like, why? That's so extra, I feel like. What's this? <laughs> Just an album. Just my celebrity of me crush. On Jess's phone. <laughs> the pimple on my chin literally says it all. Next. That's just oh my god! <laughs> Ew! Where is this? I don't know. Where is this? That's my house. Oh, is that's that my birthday? Oh my god! You have that phone? Yeah, I have my phone, my, my retro phone. That's so cool. Oh my god, I love that this. Is so funny. <laughs> that was my favorite. The which one? The drunk one? Oh my god, that one. And then Let the other one. I have to get into my purse. <laughs> chicken nickets in my purse. Did you see it? Did I close it? And then and then close it. And then this one. This one's my oh my god favorite. I like your hair like that too. Okay, this is the very reason why I got this because I'm very tired of crouching and bending and I'm almost falling because I have to prop my camera up on every single thing possible. So, your girl got herself a tripod. Finally, 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 I wanted to get one for so long. So I just got it and I opened it. It's like so cute. It extends so far. It sounds like an ad. It's literally just me saying I bought a tripod. But I'm so excited to have one. I need to get like the handheld one still because um, I didn't. I only got this one for now. Which would have made sense for me to get the other one first because I like to vlog more than use these. But at home, you know, like this situation. So, super freaking cute. Look how long this is. So cute. Amazon I think I paid like about like $50 for it which I don't think it's bad yeah that's really good actually I feel like if you bought a professional tripod it'd be like a hundred bucks so um, definitely save me money because I don't I won't use it that much so I'm pretty sure it's gonna stay in good uh, condition and yeah I'm about to go get some wine I've been trying not to buy alcohol because during quarantine I looked at my bank statements and um, I was told that I was spending 133% higher than usual on LCBO. So, I cut back. I was shook. 
I was shaken. I was distraught. I was like, how could I spend so much of my Trudeau dollars on booze? So I, I cut back and I was like, Sh what is this? And so, yeah, I'm gonna go get wine. It's been a while. And I, sw I just watched two YouTube videos back to back about people drinking and getting wine. And I'm easily influenced. I give in to peer pressure. Even though nobody pressured me, I pressured myself and I'm gonna do it. We have secured the bag, AKA a ball of wine. I have this really weird habit of always wearing AirPods or earphones, even if I'm not listening to anything or talking to anybody because it just helps me avoid talking to people. So it worked out perfectly. Anyways, I've never tried this wine before. It's just a regular Sauvignon Blanc. Nothing crazy, never tried it. I only got it because it was chilled and I didn't want to wait for a, a wine to chill, so. Okay, my favorite sound. Let's just all. Acidic. Very acidic. But it was only $15. Not only. I mean, it was wine for like $9, but I mean, ugh, so bright. Let's just tone that down just a wee bit. So, yeah. Is that sliding? Eh. Anyways, it's not bad. It's pretty good. No, I'm lying. It's not that good. Uh, <clears throat> I can feel the heartburn coming on immediately. Immediately. And um, yeah, I'm gonna drink it. And I'm drinking out of a classy and stylish mug because all my other glasses are dirty and I don't like washing it. Of course, the uh, battery is flashing that it's low. Um, good morning, hi. I feel like crap right now. I have like really bad cramps and I don't really want to leave my house but I have to get groceries. I've been needing to get groceries for like a couple days now and I've been putting it off as like long as possible. But now I have literally nothing in my fridge except for half of a pepper and some water. Um, but I might get around to that later if my Advil decides to kick in and help a girl out. Until then, my, I got some Starbucks and my friend was sleeping over so she went and got me some when she was going out. And so I have this now. And then my friend Ali is going to come over and we just like, we're going to like order in some food and, and hang out in bed, which is ideal. <laughs> Good thing we didn't make plans to go out because I, I wouldn't go out today. And um, yeah, so right now I'm just watching Bob's Burgers and waiting for him to come over around two. And I just feel like crap. And I just don't wanna leave my bed or my house or do anything. But I have an assignment due tomorrow, so I have to work on that. Very boring edit part, but this is what I'm doing. I have a discount, she just paid the bill. <laughs> Cause it's an icon restaurant. Say hi. It's a close up. Hi. <laughs> mm -hmm. Um, have we been to Patria? I don't think so. No, I've never been before. It Where is it? It wasn't that. It was. You, you know, Vestwash? oh, I've been there. Feeling mm. like the thought of it, but then you have it in front of you, and it's just like so delicious, and you just like you just can't stop eating. You know, like I love sushi. I feel you. I feel you. What? This is so random. Yeah, it's so weird. What the? F yeah, it's also soy sauce. So why the fuck did they do it like this? I have no fucking clue. <laughs> Can't sort of pour it in then. Yeah, I kind of want to mix wasabi in my soy sauce. Yeah, that's sushi. fine. Yeah, do you like that? No, just do oh. it. Yeah. <laughs> You're like, no. <laughs> that's why I'm going to keep that separate. Oh shit, I almost knocked my stuff over. 
Where's the singular number? I mean, odd number. Oh. Uh, singular number. <laughs> so bad. Oopsie as hell. <laughs> Oopsie as hell. Um. How's uh? I'm gonna make the sales, but like, how's? Okay, kind of awkward. I'm trying to find a spot, but it's, there's like no real spot. Anyway, so hello, good morning, good afternoon, good night. Um, I woke up this morning and I texted my friend Jemima and I was like, I want to get my ears pierced. And she was like, I was just thinking about that. And we literally connected in that way that we both were talking about it a couple days ago. We both woke up this morning and we we're like, let's get it done. So I got ready and we're about to go to Kensington Market. And we're gonna get, I just wanna get my second, um, my second low piercing. I've always kind of like wanted it. And I was like, ugh. But then I never really wore earrings before. And I was just like, there's no point in me getting a second piercing if I don't even wear the first piercing. But now that I've started wearing earrings a lot more, and I'm literally not wearing one right now as I'm talking about this, but now that I'm wearing them a lot more, I wanna get the second one. And I think it's just like a vibe. It's like a vibe. Anyways, whatever. Just like to have some studs, if I wear hoops, I can wear another hoop, like you know what I mean? Like you've seen it, we know, it's cute. So, um, yeah, and I want to do that, but first, I want to get tacos, because tacos are life. Um, there is this taco place close to exactly where we're going to go in Kensington Market called, like, Taqueria Gus, and I've been looking at it, I'm like staring at the camera, oh my god. I've been, um looking at it on Instagram a lot and then this guy that I used to work with posted it and he was there and I saw it and I, he didn't even tag it he literally just like posted the tacos and I was just like I know exactly where you are it's this Gus taco and he was just like yeah it is a good eye and I was like I'm going there and so the next day literally today I made the tacos because I've been craving them for about a month even though I've never tried them and that's what I want and maybe guess what baby wants ew that was so Ugh, don't even like that. Um, so she's on her way now, and I'm gonna meet her at Spadina Station, and then we'll be off. So yeah, come with me. Let's get fucking pierced. Also, taking the fact that I'm using my new tripod, <laughs> I'm so happy I got it because fuck carrying camera. Even though I'm gonna have to carry a camera when I'm on the streets, whatever. Before I go, this is a PSA to all the people that wait until we're three months into fall to go get fall sweaters. Go to H&M, go to Zara, go to Ritzia, and get yourself some fall sweaters. Don't be complaining about it three months in that they're all the ugly ones are left and you can't find any cute ones that fit you and have good styles. All they have is extra large and extra small. And baby, you're a medium. So go to the store and get yourself a freaking Turn on sweater. You want it. I want it. We both know it. Go. Meow. Okay, so I'm sitting outside of the piercing tattoo spot and I'm waiting. It's 
it's like really crazy. Like you have to only have one person in at a time and pay before, of course. And uh, she's setting up right now, so I'm just waiting on the stoop until they call us in and I can get my ears pierced. And I'm kind of nervous. I haven't gotten a piercing in a really long time. So let's see how it goes. And I don't think I can record either, which is kind of annoying, but I mean, it's fine. I'll try it on, let's see. Thanks. This one's too thick. Yeah, it's, so, so thick. Yeah. it's too the, the comparison between the dark and the light are too much. So the white one? I like the other one. This one? Mm-hmm. Goggle face. It feels a bit um that no I meant the other one from the other place. Oh yeah. The first one we tried on. Okay. 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 I just got these ones. Okay. <laughs> We're not gonna get those ones, huh? You're not gonna get these ones, right? Well, I wanna show you. Okay. These ones were like 15. Everyone knows these spots in Kensington that are so cheap for glasses. I think there's also this guy. Uh, Was this the first one we tried on? No, this is another one. Let's see. No. Nah. This one though. They have like these butterflies on them. I don't know Let's what I think about that. What you think? That's a bow, honey. That's not a butterfly. Okay, I didn't look at it. Hun, hun. The same. Five. Mm, I mean, I don't know about the. Bow. I do not like the bows at all. Neither do I. Okay, put the OG one on. OG. It was a pink one. This oh, one. Good. Always go with your gut instinct. Love. This one's better? I mean, I like it. It fits your vibe. No pressure. We can go. We don't have to get it. I like how, like, 70s they look. Though. Yeah. I love the 70s vibe. Yeah, I'll get it. <laughs> we reach a decision. This is it. Ooh. Ooh. The tag and everything is a vibe. <laughs> Oh, can you even see? Yeah, this seems right. Cool. So I'm gonna sit here so you can't see the pile of clothes behind me. And I'm literally wearing the same sweater I wore yesterday because I don't care. Um, see, so yeah, I got my ears pierced. Super cute. I feel like a freaking 15 year old girl being like, I just got pierced. Anyways. It, it kind of hurt, low key, low key. I'm good, I'm tough, but. Um, and then, you know, you when you get your, a piercing and then you forget about it 20 minutes later because the thrill only lasts for about three minutes. And then you proceed to knock your ear on everything. I remember one time when I got my cartilage pierced. I don't know why, like a week later, I decided, okay, this so I was like 16. I decided that I wanted to go to Wonderland a week later. And everyone knows Wonderland has like the most rickety rides ever. And there was like the Tomb Raider ride, I think, and you're like laying down and your head just like bobbing side to side. And it just, the pain that I felt in my upper ear. And I think that's when I decided to take it out. I was like, this sucks. Um, and that happened to me yesterday. I got caught on a sweater. I was washing my face and got caught on my rag. And then I was taking on my other earrings and hit the earring. And I just forgot. And I was sleeping directly on the earring it was just a lot, but whatever. I feel cute, got my ear pierced, whatever. And you know, it's a great day. Jemima and I got margaritas. We ate, we walked around Kensington, got sunglasses. We felt like so much fun. We're like, wow, like this is what being alive feels like. And then at 11.30 PM, she literally texted me and was just like, well, she called me and she was just like, do you know we had an assignment due tonight? And I was like, what? And then she's like, yeah. And I saw it was due tonight. I'm like, well, it's 11.30. What am I going to do now? I'm like, I'm going back to bed. What am I supposed to do? It's 11.30. And so now I had a great day. Got my ears pierced, whatever. Got some drinks, live life. But I also just lost 5% in a class. Mm. YOLO. I mean, people still say that. Um, so that kind of fucking sucks. But I mean... I'm going to try to submit it late 
and see if he still takes it and grades it. He's pretty nice. So hopefully he'll be like, it's okay, whatever. Here's your 3%. <laughs> I don't know. And um, I have to head out right now. I don't want to be late. I'm going to go meet some people. And yeah, just wanted to let you know I got my ears pierced. Whatever. Bye.